All right, here we have a, a little germanium diode kit that we've assembled that replicates the only patented way of testing radiation shielding effectiveness in devices. Um, this is a, if you look it up with the U.S. Patent Office, this is a patented method. Uh, methodology used okay no batteries included or needed and as you can see as it gets closer to the phone it picks up the radiation from the device and as you can see look look how far you can actually be from the phone and it still lights a light bulb now here we're gonna we're gonna take the pong case okay the pong all right and let's go ahead and ins install this on the ds3 one of the concerns out there were that they were saying that we weren't putting the meat, as you can see, the pong case, it lights up the light just like if nothing was, was on it. This is where your head, face, and mouth would be, okay? I mean, there is no difference. Look at this, okay? And this is the front of the case with the pong. This is the back of the case. And I want you to see just how far away we are between the device and the phone. You know what I'm saying? This. That is a lot of space, and this is still just the radiation from the phone. Okay, now look. Back on the phone. Okay, this is where we're at. Now let's go ahead and put this on an RF safe case. <clears throat> let's go ahead and show you the case. Oh, RF safe. Alright, real easy. It just snaps right into this little, little guy here, just like that. It's that easy. And now... Okay, without shielding, as you can see, it just cranks it on out there. Okay, now, let's go ahead and close it. Whammo. Open it. Okay, definitely. Big difference. And now we're just setting it right on it. Okay, and there had been a problem where, and now look, you can actually see without the shielding, it picks it up from a long ways away. You put that shielding in between you and the device, and it stops the radiation. The radiation that is lighting this light bulb in, in pure space. You just take a look at that, and that's right over top of it on it. Now let's do that to the Pong again, just to be clear. <clears throat> and let the consumers that are watching this that have purchased the Pong... Well, you tell me if you've been played or not. There you go. Sitting on top of the phone again. Okay. Now, let's cut on this microwave oven. This is where the really fun stuff starts. Here we got a microwave oven. Now, you'd never put your head next to a microwave oven, but take a look at this. That's how much. That's that's the microwave oven. That's This is a brand new microwave we just picked up at Walmart. But now you can still see this emits radiation. Okay, brand new microwave oven. Kind of more around here we had noticed a little bit. There it is. This is a brand new microwave oven. And you can see it definitely leaks radiation. And you wouldn't want that radiation exposed to you. And you would never stick your head. Look, look at that. Can you see that? Getting a good picture of the... Now that's the microwave oven. Now let's see what it looks like with the palm. You see this, people? This is your phone protected with a palm. This is how much radiation you get sticking your head up to a microwave oven. Can you see the difference here? Okay? All right, we're not trying to deceive you in any way, shape, or form. This light uses the electromagnetic energy around the phone. I'm going to put it back into the RF safe case one more time, just in case there is any idea. Look at this, people. Right here. Okay? Puts out radiation. Put that case down. Look at that. End of story. RF safe protection. Thank you very much. RFsafe.com.